button in front of Patrick Antonius. Small blind, Tony G. Action on Alan Cunningham. He's going to throw it away. Over to Andy Block. Six hundred to play. Six hundred. Six hundred. <laughs> Made it eighteen. Eighteen. You no, know, he's going to raise it up. He makes it eighteen hundred. He's got a couple of tens there. Well, it's a position he's been raising an awful lot in the cutoff. It's called the eighteen. So he's not likely to get too much respect. The <laughs> the, both the blinds have called him, and for once, he's actually got a genuine hand. Only one overcard between the two blinds, the jack. No <coughs> five, seven, five, three, seven. and look at this, we've got an action flop here. Phil Ivey's got the okay. over pair. Tony G is flop top two pair. Well, he hasn't been too lucky so far today. Five thousand. Five's called. <laughs> and you get a bet five. from Phil Ivey, five thousand dollars, and a quick call from Tony G. Surprised he didn't put a raise in there right away. The turn is the jack, and now that's one more card that he cannot beat. Check. It's a jack. You want to get rid of this one? Uh, I don't need it anymore. Bill's reaching to fire again. It hasn't been Tony G's day. You wonder if he's a little gun shy here. 14,000. And Phil Ivey's going to make it $14,000. All in. And look at this, Tony G check raises all in. That's a big, big raise with the 7-5. He knows he's only going to get his money in now in a bad spot. That's a massive raise, about $90,000 more. I can't imagine Phil calling this. The interesting thing is you wonder if he would have gotten more action on the flop. But now the jack comes out. Does that scare Phil Ivy? Pot is hundred and thirty-eight thousand dollars. Yes. Yep. Fifty, seventy, eighty, ninety-two, ninety-four, three, ninety-four, four. Ninety-four, four. How much? Ninety-four thousand four hundred. How much? 94,400. <coughs> it's almost as if Tony G is trying to buy the pot. There are plenty of kind of draws that uh, Phil can be in good shape in here. You might think that Tony G's got seven six of clubs, that kind of a hand. Tony G has really played this hand a little unorthodoxly. And you can see the wheels turning. All the players very interested. This is a big pot, $140,000 pot. I can tell you one thing's for certain. Phil Ivey wishes he hadn't bet that 14,000 now. Trying to replay the hand in his head. What is Tony G trying to represent here? Such a strange bet on the turn. You can see maybe it's confused Phil Ivey a little bit. As you can see from the percentages, it wouldn't be the end of the world for Phil if he does make the call. He's still got a few cards he can catch. The three, the jack, or the ten. Right. He's counting. He was stuck about 80,000 earlier on in this tournament, uh, early on in this cash game. He'd managed to grind himself back to only about 25,000 behind. If he makes this call, he's in an even worse state. Interestingly enough, if Tony G had not <coughs> rebought, you wonder how quickly Phil Ivey would have called. 
Yeah, you're right. If this is 50,000 less, I'm pretty sure Ivy would have called by now. Could be thinking Jack flush draw. Could have had two 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 big hearts. He's caught the Jack, and that's 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 going to cripple Phil's hand. I think he's going to muck. Well, that's the interesting thing. If Tony G had something like Queen Jack of Club, Queen Jack of Hearts, your tens are no good there. You can really only beat something like seven, six of clubs. Of course, the big difference between this and tournament play is if he gets this wrong, he's not out of the tournament. He can just pull up some more money. He sat down with $200,000 dropping the ocean to a man who's won over 8 million in tournaments, not counting what he's won in side games. The Tony G obviously winning. Rebought for another $50,000 here. Making this call even harder for Phil Ivey. Phil Ivey, one of the greatest players in the game today. The wheels are turning there. Obviously, all the players. Cool. Well, he's decided to call. He's in bad shape, but he has got a few cards to catch. He needs a three, a jack, or a ten. Or this $233,000 pot is going to go to Tony G. Hey. <coughs> Last card. In it's the a river, king. It's a king of clubs, yeah, and Tony right. G is going to win this pot. Yeah. <laughs> and a big smile for Tony G there as he takes out a $233,000 pot. And Phil Ivey not happy at all. Obviously, the big overbet check raise there on the turn confused Phil Ivey. He had a 10.